M0 FXB, welcome back to the channel. TRD Radio H3, connected to the TRD station by Nick Shaw, Marcus. This is version 37B. Also, we've got the latest Nick Shaw firmware as well that adds the, uh, the signal meter that you can see there. And if I transmit, if I just change frequency, Just that, like so. I could have done it using the software, couldn't I? But anyway, if I transmit, you'll see there's a power meter there as well, which I think is pretty cool. So yeah, I should have just used the um, the software. So let's do four, three, four, five, five, zero. Enter, and there you are. You saw it change. We're back onto that channel. If you go to menu 46, just scrolling down there, you can see the menus. Look, the squelch, backlight, beep, jeweled watch. Keep going down. Eventually, you'll see the new ultra power, ultra low power mode. So what's the point of that? Well, if you're using an all-star node like I am, then uh, it, obviously you're using a lot less power because the node will be in your room. We've got brightness here as well, which is bright. Let's go to number three. It's quite bright on my camera, so we've dimmed it now. Part of the new mod that Marcus has done is it adds 1000 megahertz. I mean, just the the window that we're seeing and the signal meter f is is enough for me. I actually haven't tested to see. I know it says a little PTT button there. And look here, there's a, a signal meter. I haven't tested that. So uh, that's a new one that I haven't seen before. You can even update the firmware using this. There's all your programming channels. You know, record and save. Memories. If you hit the lightning bolt, you can actually install the firmware as well. Sometimes people say, can you get CB bands? And you can type it in. You can go 0270011. There you are. There's a CB band. And yes, it does work very well on AM, but you do have to enable it. You go menu. I believe it's number 46. Nope, that's ultra low power. Let's have a look. 48. But did you notice you can type the menu? So there's 48 AM band. Just make sure you turn it on. Select up and down. Select. And then you've got all shortcuts here as well. If you back out with the orange button, go menu and then touch these shortcuts. So there's one there. Takes you straight to power. It's a 5 watt radio. A lovely screen on this, and of course, lots of lots of memory channels that you can add as well. So if you go offline, if you look here, you just click offline, then you get these options now where you can start reading your, you know, looking at this bottom section here. So let's go to, at the bottom here, we've got arrows, we're going to click COM6. And it's now, you see that loading up at the bottom? about the pause so that was writing and this one this arrow here is download from the radio com6 and then it downloads from the radio writes to the radio click up here a little book there flick back and forth a and b there Okay, well, I'll put the GitHub link for the TRD station. There's there's several different versions available, and the TRD Facebook link, and the original firmware link as well. Bye for now, 73.